Okay, let's just say it's been an interesting night so far. Uh, I got home from work, and like, I don't know, maybe an hour later, my wife went off to uh, do the girls' night. Uh, basically, a friend of ours, well, friend of my wife was dating and then got engaged to a friend of mine. Uh, that I've known since freaking grade school. Uh, known him in grade school, a little bit in high school. Uh, after high school, it was like a uh, disappearance. We reconnected mu with music. Uh, oh my god, maybe 2013, some shit like that. Uh, anyhow, they were engaged. And he recently broke it off with her. Uh, no real reason other than that, oh, uh, you know, she doesn't spend enough time with him, he doesn't spend enough time with her, all kinds of BS. Uh, but needless to say, you know, he kind of told her, oh, well, you know, don't worry, there's nobody else, this and that, blah, 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 and not even within a week, man. There's pictures up on Facebook and social media and shit. He's already with another girl. She's posting and tagging him and blah, blah, blah. So, you know, basically they went and did this girl's night out so that uh, his ex fiance can prove to him she does have a life. She does go out, hang out with friends, this and that. Uh, I will be honest, man. Not knowing him, man, knowing him the way he is. Probably some kind of freaking dick douchebag move that he pulled because he's he's done it before. I've I've seen it. Uh, I not to this level though. But anyhow, while she's out, I'm enjoying myself, man. Catching up on some TV shows. Uh, excuse me. I, I'm catching up on some other stuff too. Uh. So basically, TV shows. Now I'm watching Super Troopers. I got uh, something called uh, Major League Wrestling Fusion lined up for uh, 9 o'clock today. Uh, apparently, it's like Fight Night in Philly or something. Uh, I figured, let me check it out, man, because it says it's comparable to stuff like WWE, AEW, Ring of Honor. So why not, man? Enjoy myself, ha have a little me time, man. Uh, I'm like having my own little self party here. Just got done eating uh, some, some leftover steak and green beans. Join a bottle of strawberry wine while I'm watching all this. Yeah, you know, might as well do a vlog and catch everybody up on what's going on with the uh, new version of Justice D. DeVille. Let's just go by Justice DeVille. And who knows, man. Maybe next time I'm in GTS, I can break out the notorious DDT. <laughs> the, the glorious. Yeah, because uh, one of my friends actually said, you know, with the hair cut and this and the facial hair starting to come in, you know, I, I'm starting to get that uh, Robert Rude look. I don't know. I, I don't really see it yet. But whatever. Anyhow, man, if I got any more to add to this, I'll add to it. But, you know, I'm on my second glass of wine, enjoying some movies, waiting for that wrestling show to come on. Who knows? We'll see where it goes from there. So you're getting ready to watch that wrestling show. It's coming on in about three minutes. I'm on my third glass of wine already. Uh, doing laundry. Finally got that in the dryer. Um. Uh, yeah, I'm just having a nice, total, fucking relaxing night. Uh, not sure where it's going to take me, other than probably bed later. <laughs> uh, but it's all that, and then get ready to go to GTS taping in the morning. Uh, not sure what they're going to do with me yet, how they're going to use me. 
Especially considering I've been gone for, what, like a fucking month now. Uh, but let's see what happens. Let's see if some of the training that I was able to get in pays off. Who knows, man. We'll see where it goes from here. So here I am. I'm about 18 minutes into the show, man. And I gotta say, I've already seen Conan. The Dynasty. Uh, some dude who's like, almost, reminds me of Stone Cold, only different. <laughs> uh, <coughs> I'm waiting for the match that's coming up, man, because apparently somebody I've actually met on, on, on the scene here in Jersey, Jordan Oliver, just came out with two other guys uh, I'm waiting for that match to come up whatever's coming up next it's wow be in sports channel I, I am surprised that what I'm seeing I am I'm kind of digging it man it, major league wrestling fusion is what it's called on be in sports channel I, I am wow uh, I'm waiting to see who else might be on here that uh, I've met, no, etc. I, I, it's definitely something worth watching. Uh, it's like GTS, but on TV. Let me put it that way. I'm totally blown away right now. Holy shit, man. They got Mark Adam Haggerty is the ring announcer. And Laredo Kid just walked out, man. He's actually on my friends list on Facebook. Uh, I think I think I also got him on Twitter. Holy shit, man! I am like just, it's like, wow, wow! I can't believe it, man. It's like people I know, people I talk to, people I've met. I am, wow. <laughs> That's all I gotta say is wow. I am digging this right now. This is This is like yeah, when they say fusion, it's a fusion of like all the brands I where I have actually met people, got to talk to them, know them, etc. Wow. I, I I'm blown away. This is yeah, yeah, and with GTS Live coming up March 21st, New Egypt High School, that, that there's another step for the wrestling world. GTS moving up, these guys moving up, Rest, wrestling, uh, as long as it doesn't get oversaturated with this market, man, this is... Oh my God, I can't, I can't believe what I'm seeing and everything that is going on today for wrestling. It, it is a resurgence. I, I'm speechless. I, I, I can't speak. I, I'm, man, yeah. To put it to put it simply, Deville is done talking. That's how speechless I am with this. Deville is done talking. Holy shit.